All right, so what's up, Knuckle Up? So here we go. So here's a little drill that I'm working on. I got my brother, his wife here, and my son, and I'm pretty much working on how to hit off a conversation stance with pretty much adding a front step. So pretty much what I'm gonna do is from this stance here, all I'm gonna do is use the whole Jack Dempsey falling step of grabbing my left leg and then just moving it forward. Why am I doing this? Because understanding that most all fights are gonna start off a conversation stance or a handshaking range. From this range here, something's gonna happen. Be it he's gonna shift back, he's gonna reach for something, or he's gonna step forward. So in my case, my best bet is off this stance, I need to learn how to generate maximum power off this conversation stance. And the way to do that is utilizing Jack Dempsey's old school falling step, applying all of my body weight into my lead leg. So when I drop down, I'm shooting maximum power. So me personally, if I'm teaching somebody for the first time, I won't start you here because I understand that most stuff is always gonna work from here and the minute I get pushed or something happens or I strike, now I'm ready in my boxing stance to go ahead and continue the attack or do whatever it is that I have to do to get out of a situation. So basically anybody that's, I guess, teaching or wanting to learn, this is how, I'm, this is how I teach the falling step from that conversation stance before I teach anything else. So from here, first thing we're gonna do is just get in this conversation stance Loosen up, grab the leg, and drop forward. What this does, this applies all of my body weight onto that lead leg. Now from this position here, once I've done this 10 times, or as many times as you need until you feel comfortable, once again, I'm still pushing off my rear leg. Now I'm just gonna add a tiger claw, not a palm, because understanding that the tiger claw allows me to have nails, and nails allow DNA. So if I'm here and I can hit and I can get a scratch or anything, even if something bad happens to me, at least I have some kind of DNA under my nails. So I prefer to hit somebody here than hit somebody right here. So basically now I would come and just come right up. And that's basically how I would teach the first strike with a step working off a conversation stance. Let me know what you think.